In this video, I am going to show, how can we remove spots from skin and can do skin retouching. First, make a copy of the original image by pressing Command or Ctrl J. Select Spot Healing Brush Tool. Proximity Match and Create Texture should not be selected. Content Aware and Sample All Layers should be selected. Hardness should be around 80% and spacing 25%. The size of the brush should be same as spot size or slightly larger. Click on the spots once or twice as needed. Remove as much spots as we can. Make two copies by pressing Command or Ctrl J and then convert both layers to Smart Object by doing right click and select Convert to Smart Object. Hide the fourth layer by clicking on the eye next to it. Select third layer and go to Filter and then Blur and then select Gaussian Blur. The radius should be 10 to 12 and then click OK. Now, select fourth layer and unhide it by clicking on the eye next to it. Change the blending mode to vivid light. Then go to filter. Then others. And select high pass. The radius should be 2 to 3. Click OK. Hold Ctrl key and click on third and fourth layer to select both layers and press Ctrl G to group them. Press Alt and click on add a mask. It will create inverse mask. Now, select Brush Tool. The hardness should be 0%. Mode should be normal, opacity 100% and flow should be 50%. Now, paint the face. Make sure the foreground color is white. Paint only the skin of the face. Make sure to paint the neck as well otherwise the color would look different from the face. After that change the flow to 30%, now paint the face and neck again. Take a screenshot by pressing Shift Ctrl Alt and E. It actually takes sample from all the layer and create a new layer. Select the above layer and go to Adjustment layer and select Levels. Drag the right pointer to left little bit. And left pointer to right. Go to Layers and decrease the opacity. Keep it 60 to 70 percent. Again go to adjustment layer and select curves this time. Hold the line from here and move it slightly upward. Then hold the line from here and move it slightly lower. Go to layers and decrease the opacity. Keep it between 60 to 70 percent. Take a screenshot by pressing shift ctrl alt and e. Then delete unwanted layers, as we don't need them and it will also reduce the size of the file. Now, go to filter. Then sharpen and then select smart sharpen. 
adjust the amount and radius as needed and as per your image. Click OK. See, we have done the skin retouching. In this way you can do the skin retouching of any image. You can also change the color of the lips. For that watch my other video. The link is in description. This is before. And this is after. That's it for now. Keep learning.